Greetings everyone, Xanrath here. Welcome back to more Only Heroics. And, uh, like I said last time, it's, uh, it's about time we cheat a little bit. Um, I figure... I've essentially beaten this game in its entirety, more or less. Um, and fairly legitimately, I'll say. And so, there really isn't all that much more to do. I do want to show, you know, the last of the storylines that we haven't seen yet. Um, and, you know, all that stuff I've been talking about in the last three episodes and just couldn't do. Uh, so, I figure instead of, you know, wasting time and me putzing around trying to find stuff, uh, just randomly or by chance, uh, it's time to, it's time to utilize the, the glorious old internets and, um, basically find some worlds where the things that we want to do is going to be easier because, you know, we've already done everything the legit way, so might as well start shortcutting it. Um, so first of all, like I said, I want to go ahead and grab ourselves some, um, uh, some holy items. <clears throat> and, uh, I have been playing a little bit off camera just to kind of verify some of these worlds that I want to try out and show you guys. That'll make it easier for you if you want to also go in and experience some of this stuff by yourself. So I turned, uh, online mode back on. That was, uh, not that, um, right here. So, um, we do have some, uh, different worlds down here now. These are the daily things that I've, I've turned it off for most of the time just because I didn't want to see all those things on the side where it's like other people playing in this world as well. Anyways, <clears throat> so I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm going to sit with the hero class and you see I have a bunch of like swimming and cliffhanging and whatever. That's just to help me maneuver around while I was exploring these worlds. Anyways, first of all, like I said, we wanted to grab some uh, some holy items. So I found a great place to, to basically farm uh, holy items. In this world, it's called uh, Hatsune, uh, H-A-T-S, oops, not that, S-U-N-E, all caps. We're going to go in uh, afternoon stroll, why not? <clears throat> so this world is really great because, um, pretty sure I turned off Maniac Mode, right? Because I need to grab myself... Um, which I'm gonna call it Key of Seals or Key of Se yeah Key of Seals. Grab one of those. And this is really great because right off the bat, you just go right, 10 kilometers, approximately or so, and boom, holy uh, holy uh, shrine with uh, two chests. Go ahead and use that. Nice, nice. What we got? What you got? Ooh, a lance. Great. And a heavy shield. Perfect! Alright, that's exactly what I wanted. I wanted a lance. So now we just go ahead and kill ourselves. There we go. And, oh no, it's too bad we died. But... We got ourselves, uh, some holy items to drop into our good old, uh, whatchamacallit, dimensional vault. That was easy, huh? Done. Farming has never been easier. And what's that? You want to do it again? Yeah, sure, why not? Let's go ahead and do it again. And, um... <clears throat> I have found a couple other dimensions where uh, you have, like, two or three holy shrines within, like, the first hundred kilometers or something like that. But this one is, like, right here. You know, it's ten kilometers. You're not going to run into anyone. Um... Yeah, you're not gonna run into any mobs or anything. Let's go ahead and uh, let's grab ourselves our lance. Let's go ahead and beef up this weapon real quick. Okay, let's go ahead and equip that. We can drop some of this stuff so we don't accidentally buff that instead. So we got our weapon, that's equipped. Buff that up. Yep, nice. Alright. Oops. Hold on. Alright, now we have some super weapon going on here. So where's the. There's this one. Could throw some more stuff on there. Because why not, right? Uh, 
Alright, how's our weapon look now? God slaying, huh? Power to slay a deity. I wonder if that's going to help in terms of uh, killing... Is the Dark Dragon a deity? I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. But... All stats increase. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. We got some super stats there. Super stats. Um, what else we got? I'm gonna hold on to the some of these just just for now. Um, I'm gonna grab another one of these keys. Oh boy. Well, that's unfortunate. See ya. So yeah, just kidding. I guess you will run into people, or some mobs. Huh. No. Leave me alone! Just wanna... Grab loot and be on my way. Ah. No, I didn't even get the... Ah, that's... Well... <clears throat> you know... That's something how... That's sometimes how it works out. That was actually really sad. I'm really sad that I lost the key of seal, just... <laughs> But, anyways, we have this super nice uh, weapon drop in here now. Super nice. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, farm farm some more. This episode will basically just be me farming. Um, so, now that you know the secret, um, you know. Basically, what I think I'm going to do in the next couple episodes will basically just be uh, each episode will be devoted to doing one thing that we have not done before. So, you know, like seeing Freda's storyline, seeing um, the King. I think we haven't seen the King storyline. Um, there's one other character that I have not um, encountered yet, and I'm not going to mention it just yet in case um, but you guys probably already know who that is. I don't think I've seen Dozy's storyline. And uh, of course. After farming, we're going to go ahead and kill the, um, the Dark Dragon with our ill-gotten gains. Oops, I don't want to pick up the Demon Lord's coat. Um, there's our super nice buff weapon. I wonder how many times... Can you just buff this infinitely? Like, wh is there like a limit to how many stats you can have? And then after a certain amount, it'll just stop buffing? Or it'll like replace certain uh, like previous ones? Or like if you just start going off the screen and you just like you just can't even tell anymore. That'd be pretty amusing. <clears throat> Anyways, hopefully no uh, double fairies that have two times movement will run into me this time. Good. All right, we're in the clear. <clears throat> cool, cool. Grab ourselves some. Uh... Oh, another <laughs> another lance, huh? That's that's nice. Oh, okay. I think I... I think I get it. I think each... Okay. So maybe this isn't the best way. I thought... I thought each uh, dimension... Like, each time you see a holy whatever majig... Oops. <laughs> totally did not put that into my whatever. Because um, it doesn't really matter that much, right? Because... Okay, so I see. Um... So I guess each world, each holy shrine, it's not randomly generated. Each holy shrine will have whatever uh, it has. So in this case, this particular world, you'll always have the spear and you'll always have the shield. I'm guessing that's the case. I mean, two out of two, not necessarily sure. Um, it's not necessarily confirmed, I should say. But I do happen to know another world and we can try it out. And this one is called Alpha. Alright. Let's go ahead and go in a... And I think this holy shrine... I think this world has two holy shrines. One of which is about 14 kilometers. The other one is, I think, around 100. But it's, like, surrounded by mountains. And so it's really hard to get to. So let me go ahead and grab... Uh, two keys didn't I have I had eight I used one I lost one because I used it wait didn't I use three and I started with eight how come I had six to start this time that's interesting anyways I believe it's 14 kilometers and it's way down here in the south is it here it is there's the door down here 
Got it. Alright, what do you got? You have an axe. Alright. And plate armor. And that's too much for me to hold, so I'm gonna go ahead and drop some stuff. Go on, drop. Drop. Uh, drop the herbs. And we're good. And we're good. Wanna rumble? I'm not using the axe, am I? I'm not. Okay. Next one, I think, is at 100 kilometers. We'll see. <clears throat> Remember, I have those points in. I should have put all the points into mountain climbing or cliffhanger, whatever it's called, since I don't plan on swimming. Anyways. Um, so, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Each world is... Each world is going to be the way it is, you know, it's not going to be random. So, holy items still are not random. <clears throat> um, in which case, I guess this isn't really farming unless you specifically want, you know, in the other world, Hatsun, if you specifically want a shield and a spear, and this world is an axe and a plate mail in the first one, and I think there should be, like I said, there should be, um... Oh, but I'm going to run out of energy. That's going to be good. Should have kept those herbs. Um. And then we'll see. Yeah, let's, let's see what... Uh, I think it's right there. You see it? I don't know if this is the right way or not. Hopefully it is. Not this one. Should be up a little bit more. Yeah, it wasn't that building. It should be here, I think. Ish. So in here? Yep, there it is. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and climb. One, two, three, four. Good. Open that up. And this is plate armor, too. And this is axe, too. No, this is a sword. Alright, well. Let me go ahead and drop some of this stuff. Grab that. Pick that up. Don't need that. Whoa! What is that? A ghost. Toonie's ghost. Please, please defeat the demon lord in my steed. Whoa! What happened, dude? That's interesting. Anyways, we got some uh, some items here. So let's go ahead and... Uh, oops! My bad! Uh, what? Why do I have to do this? Am I supposed to do this? Ah, ha, 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 ha. I don't know. Alright, let's see what we got. Terror armor, terror armor. Cool. Alright. <clears throat> let's drop that stuff in here. Oh, it's flame burst. Oh, it even has some special items. Nice. That's cool. And that's the kind of sword I like. The four, the four weight one. Because the two, the two weight one's kind of weak. The eight one has the missing accuracy or the chance to miss. And, um, <clears throat> what else, what other swords are there? There's that eagle one. That's also eight. That's pretty cool too, I guess. Anyways, terror armor. What does terror armor do? Legendary armor crafted by, mis uh, created from mysterious armor plates. Very light and strong in both physical and force defense. 30% fire nullification. That's nice. Holy Axe Elizabeth. Um, it will always deliver a critical strike. Suffers 20% loss in accuracy, but it... Yeah, its attack power is unparalleled. It's, it's a lot. So cool. We got some stuff to stuff into our dimensional vault. What is this from again? Wow, that's a lot of... Uh, fire nullification. I'm guessing that's what's probably good for... Um, the, 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 the what's gonna call it the dark dragon right cuz is that right I mean the only things I've encountered there's the demon lord who has fire attacks there's the flame imp who throws fire stuff at you there's the um, fire breathing modifier that you can get on just random mobs and um, I'm guessing dragons have fire damage just a guess more cases than not, unless it's like an ice dragon or something. But anyways, um, well, those are two worlds that you can go ahead and farm, um, kind of farm some uh, some uh, holy items. So you can get a uh, a lance 
and, um, what was it, a shield? Gale shield? What does this do? Legendary shield imbued with powers of the wind to make extremely light, 20% evasion, perfect for, uh, perfect fit for those critical battles. So yeah, you can, you, you can get a shield and a lance in that first world, 10 kilometers, um, what's it called, uh, Hatsune? H-A-T-S-U-N-E, all caps, I'll put these in the description as well. And then this world that we just were in, Alpha, uh, capital A, lowercase, L-P-H-A, there's one at 14 kilometers, which was the axe, right? The axe and the, the plate armor, and then there was the, um, this sword, the four attack, the four weight sword, and, uh, plate armor also at, um, 100, approximately 100 kilometers, but you do need to put a lot of points into, um, uh, what's it called, cliffhanger. At least three, I guess I would recommend, approximately. Um, might as well put all five in, because, you know, if you're going to these worlds, you know, doing what I'm doing, you're just, you're just grabbing these, these holy items and, and bailing. So, anyways, that is how you kind of farm for, uh, holy items. If you guys have any other dimensions that, um, are good for getting other holy items like the staff, the other swords. Um, what else can you get? I wonder if you can get a bracelet, like a holy bracelet, uh, a bow, whether what other, whatever other stuff there is. Uh, if you have a good dimension, we can get that early on. Uh, you know, let me know, put it in the comments, share with the rest of the world. Um, otherwise, you can probably wiki it um, or Google, whatever you prefer to search with. Anyways, that's basically it for this episode. It's all about grabbing those holy items next time um next time we'll probably uh kill some stuff we'll see who we want to kill um or yeah uh until next time thanks for watching bye